Hello, I'm Robin Feigt, and today I'm going to show you how to make these adorable little cocoa packs. We're going to start with a sheet of crumb cake designer paper, and I already have my markers marked for four and four and a half. Or my sheet at four and four and a half. This is going to give the little spine to tuck the cocoa in. Each sheet will make two packets. We're going to cut that at five and a half. And as you can see, then we have a nice little spine to make our cocoa packs. Let's set these aside for now and we're going to do our front cover. Let's start with a piece of very vanilla cardstock. It's cut at three and a quarter and three and a quarter. And we'll begin stamping our images. We'll start with the little snowflakes that come in the this is called the Merry Winter Set. We're going to use Baja Breeze. We'll make a little ribbon of snowflakes across our bottom. And then we'll do our sled, which is also in here, and we'll do that in Riding Hood Red. Now to stamp our snowmen. We have a chubby little fella. Don't they look like little mush, um, marshmallow fellows? They just look so squeezable. Sort of reminds me of that Charmin commercial. I just want to squeeze them. Just perfect for the hot cocoa packs. Let's color his cap. Baja Breeze. And we'll color his scarf, Riding Hood Red. Notice how I'm using sort of the side of my brush tip end of my marker. And we'll do the buttons also. Let's do his carrot, Pumpkin Pie. And then we'll just take the basic gray and color any lines that are just his outline. We'll huff on that. <gasps> that will moisten it. And we'll stamp. To add our label, I have some Riding Hood Red paper and some chocolate chip ink. It has several little images that we could stamp and put on our card. It has merry winter, snowy days, frosty nights, warm hearts, snow much fun, and love doesn't melt. And we, You can play around with that and make different packets depending on who you're going to give those to. So I'm going to do the snow much fun, stamp that with the chocolate chip ink, and I'm going to punch that with the one inch square punch. And I will punch a little postage stamp with the chocolate chip. We also need a piece of Riding Hood red paper. That's going to be our background. This piece is four and a quarter by three and three quarters. We're going to use our eyelet border punch. And the way I like to do this is I like to look at the corner here, up in the corner of the punch, and I put the corner of my card the corner of my cardstock in the corner of my punch. And squeeze and then you'll see that you have a new corner and I'm going to put that up in the corner and punch. Place those on our packet I have put a stamp and dimension on the back of our sentiment We'll place him up in the corner. Then you should have some cocoa packs. And take your mini glue dots and just go ahead and apply a few to the back of your cocoa pack just by pressing. 
and we'll just we're just going to press those on the inside of our packet. We'll use some eighth inch ribbon. We'll be able to just tie that shut with our ribbon. And we have our little cocoa packs. So go ahead, try some yourself. Make them for your friends and your family and your acquaintances, co-workers, your children's teachers. Have them ready on hand as gifts for this winter. Thanks for stopping at St Stampin' Country.